men nowadays kill themselves more often. They're more depressed, anxious, and feminine than ever before. Modern society wants to brainwash men to think that they should be feminine and that they should be docile, that men are supposed to be feminine. Therefore, young men and little kids in school, they're taught to shut up, to not speak unless they raise their hand in class, and they're punished for practicing anything masculine. They're punished for being little boys, punished for being competitive and wanting to be the best men they could be. Not only this, but they're being taught that it's okay for them to change their sex and they can decide if they want to be men or female. They can chop off their own balls and dicks. And on top of this, if they decide that they don't want to be like this, they want to be more masculine, they're punished for this, and they're framed as misogynistic assholes. And basically, what I, all that I'm trying to fucking say here is that men are not happy. Yes, I've said it. I'm not afraid to speak reality. I'm not going to make a false reality like most people would because I can already hear some people coping, being like, oh no, my, my men, masculine men should, are not necessary. We don't even need men in this world because it's, it's totally fine. Because the, no, this is so fucking bullshit. I hate these people that are like, oh no, we don't need men because, because they're not necessary. But however, whenever, whenever a problem arises, whenever they're in danger, masculine men is the first thing that they look, that they look up to for an answer. As soon as they're in danger, they call the police. As soon as something breaks in their house, they call a masculine man that, that can fix the issue. Masculine men are needed. Masculine men are what help families thrive. They teach their kids good values. And they teach their kids to be strong masculine men, to provide for their family, to be disciplined, to be stoic. To practice stoicism. This world was created by masculine men. Cities, the roads, the car that you drive. Your house, it was built by masculine men. You're not going to tell me that you, masculine men are not necessary in this world because they are. Not only in families, not only for their physical use, but also because of their mental, it's for mental and physical, physical use. You need to be strong physically as well as mentally. You need a strong masculine man physically as well as mentally that will take care of the family, that will lead the family on, that will lead the family to continue growing and becoming stronger. I have nothing against women, but this is the truth. Kids that were that were raised by single moms, they're more likely to become drug addicts, to become bad kids. And you can literally search this up because this is nothing against women. This is actually against these these weak men that left these families, that left these kids alone. I'm speaking to you. A young man that resonates with this message and is, and is convinced and has already figured it out that, that the modern world wants to keep you weak. Why? Because more feminine men, all this LGBTQ fucking bullshit movement, all this body positivity shit, it is all made for you to stay weak because weaker men, more feminine men, they're more susceptible to peer pressure. They're more easily convinced and, and they can take away your money a lot easier than, than masculine men that have their beliefs, that have their opinions. But just because someone tells them that, oh, it's okay to chop off their balls, they're going to be like, no, why the fuck would I do that? That is the reason why they want to keep you feminine and weak. That is the reason why they're teaching all this bullshit in school. So don't come to me with this fucking bullshit of being feminine is, ob is okay because ever since men are more feminine, they lack discipline, they're less masculine, they kill themselves more often, depression rates are through the roof, testosterone is super low, and the world is going to shit. We need strong masculine men. And just because I'm advocating for strong masculine men, for good mental health, for self-improvement, men's men self-improvement, doesn't mean I'm anti-woman. So I don't want to hear any fucking idiot saying that, oh, he's misogynistic or he's, he's all this bullshit, just like they do with any masculine man nowadays. Men should and they must go through discomfort. They must be disciplined. They must be strong physically as well as mentally. They must hit the gym because this teaches their mind as well as their body to, to endure pain, to become stronger. They must be confident and charismatic because the more experience that this man is, the more pain that he has gone through, the stronger that he is, that he is, the more experienced and the better man that he will be because these men, the ones that are stronger physically as well as mentally, they're disciplined. They make money for the family. They hit the gym. These are the men that, that create great families, big, strong sons. They give them good values and they make families thrive.
And I'm telling this to you because if you're a masculine man that relates with this message and, and you can, you can, you can, you, you hear calling you, you, you know that I'm speaking to you because I'm speaking to you. You want to be masculine. You have a desire to be strong, to make money, to be confident. Hit the gym. Do it. Hit the gym. Make money as much as you can. Do it through the right means, of course. However, it is okay to be make money. Do it for your family. Do it for your future self. Do it for the protection and, and, and the security of your family. Don't allow anyone to tell you that you're wrong for this. Yes, know that it will be hard. Know that it is... That you must be disciplined. You must practice discipline. You must be willing to wake up and put in the hard work even when you don't feel like it. Even when there's no motivation. Even when you're tired, you still have to put in the work. Know that you will have to do that. Because that is what men that thrive in this world do. And know that you will be criticized and you will be judged by the brainwashed people of this world. But trust me that you will be, you will have a so much more amazing life than anyone else. You will thrive. Do it for your future self.